Hey guys, it's Carrie. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're going to be taking a look at um, two sets from the Barbie and Barbie Princess Adventure. I don't. I think this. Yeah. Okay. So this is a movie. These are sets that came out for a movie. Uh, we don't have any of the dolls that go to this, uh, but I do have. I do. I did want to change one of my um, AliExpress girls in a different outfit. As much as I like the Powderpuff Girls, I'm ready for a change and switch up. So, uh, we're gonna, uh, try these outfits on her. We might get another Barbie, too, um, to show you how it looks like on Barbie, but, um, the first one, the one that I'm really interested in opening is this one with the pig. So, we're gonna get everything out of this package. Um, it says 3 plus on here, and then, like I said, on the back, it's got all these, um, all the, uh, characters from the movie on it, and... Yeah, I don't know if there was any other sets, but these are the only two sets that we were we've got our hands on. And I think they were at what is a Target for $9.99. Was they $9.99 or are they more than that? I think they were like $10. Bucks. But let's go ahead and get it open. There's a really cute pig in here. I really I'm excited to open this one. Um and I can open it up with one hand. That's pretty cool. Alright, and this pops out. So these booths right here, I know we've seen. We have a fashionista that we've had in, on this channel in the past. One of the tall ones with braids. She has the lavender version of these. And I think we also have a transparent version of these for the uh, for the rocker type uh, fashionista. So I do like these boots a lot. I don't mind having them in different colors. Okay. So I think we might need to get scissors here. Or we can just pull them out like I always do. Hope for the best. Hope we don't end up with holes. Okay, the skirt is... Okay. One thing I can say about the skirt is that it is hemmed. There's no raw edges on it. I don't know what how to describe the material that it is. It's like this foil. It's stiff. But I think the stiffness is going to give it um, the look that we want. We have a long sleeve t-shirt over here. It's gray, striped with white, and it's got a heart on it that's pink. This is awesome. A little crown. I don't know what color to call this. It's like a foil, like a foil blue periwinkle. Here's our tiara. That's lavender. I don't know if that's going to fit our girl. Here is a heart-shaped um, shoulder purse. That's pink. It doesn't open, but it it has decent detail. I don't even have a zipper on this one, though. But it's got some cute rib cute rivets that go around it. So, it's a little cheaper than some of the other purses, but here we go. There's a nice amount of detail on this pig. So cute! Okay, he's, no, he's not articulated, he's just a figure. Or she's just a figure. And she has a little matching tool skirt that kind of matches the coloration of the skirt that goes with this. This little pig has a really light, light, light blue eye, I think. No, they're just, they're just white. It's just white with black pupils. But it's cute. It's a cute pig. The scaling seems right. And then we have these glasses, which we know for a fact are not going to fit on our girl, but those are cool sunglasses anyway. And then we also have a cell phone. A white cell phone. But it can hold. Put that out. Let's go ahead and put the outfit on this girl and see how it works. So here's our model dressed up in this outfit here. I'm not sure how I feel about it. It it seems to work pretty well. I mean, other than the glasses, even the even the tear headband type thing worked on her. Um, I like her better in this than the outfit she was wearing. I mean, not better, but like it's different switch up. And the pig is so adorable. I, I, I do. I like this outfit. It's 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 a little bit more new age than I'm used to with Barbie, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Um, either way, I think it does look, look good. Um, we're going to try and grab another model for this outfit over here. I've got a little bit of a beef with this one, but I'll, I'll talk to you about that um, as we're opening it. Um, actually, you know what? I'm just going to open it right here on camera. I was able to do it with the other one. Um, 
one thing we didn't talk about with the other outfit is that the background on this on this blister pack has a almost like a castle type thing where you can see the puppies in coming out of a little door there and the coffee cup is yeah this is a little bit more what's that's weird hmm okay i guess that's so that you can keep the back flap if you wanted to or somehow somehow my double layer came on un undone but we're gonna do this because opening up clothes does save a little bit of space. Okay. Let's see here. So we're gonna pull that out, put it over here, and pick that up later. We have some purple. I think these are flats. That's the problem. I think, you know what, um, it's not actually so much of a problem. It's good that we have flat shoes because there's not a lot of flats out there. But that means we have to find a flat model. I, I think we're going to end up using the Barbie that I really just I really just despised out of the pool set. And, uh, and give her a new look. I don't think it's going to make me like her anymore. But at least it gives her a little bit of playtime. So let's see. Okay, so there's another shoulder purse here. That is a um, ugh, a lavender color. It's almost the same color as the uh, other color of those boots were from the pa last pack. Um, let's see. We have a skirt. Now this skirt is a light teal color. Um, it's a thinner fabric than the fabric that we had in the last pack. And we have the elastic band is a shimmery silver. And then we have silver uh, glitter painted on stars all over this skirt. And a raw edge at the bottom, which is a really irritating thing. This this skirt right here, uh, the Dollar Tree does better. Okay, the jacket's really good quality, and that's what they do. They give you a good quality top with a bad quality bottom. So how is this going to work? Okay, so this is like a this jacket's a it's a jacket shirt because there's no shirt with it, but it does have velcro on the front, so that's gonna keep it sealed so that um, her lady parts don't fall out. But it's a gonna obviously be a quarter sleeve, but I like this metallic-y, shimmery pleather fabric that's going on here. That's uh, pink and I don't know what color that is. It's almost like a a teal, like a, a metallic teal. Not one sleeve. And then we have a little chihuahua dog. Uh, and we have a white to-go coffee mug. Uh, a Tierra headband. And I think one of those is the dog's collar. And then one of those is supposed to be a bracelet. I don't know. We'll figure that one out too. Um, be right back, guys. Okay, side note, I tried to use Barbie I didn't like to make Barbie better than I, whatever, but I, uh, I thought these were flat feet shoes, but they're not. They're pointed feet shoes, so I will be using another one of my AliExpress uh, Japanese girls, so we're going to switch this outfit up to this one and see what happens. Okay, guys, so here is this outfit, uh, minus the tiara that won't fit on her big head. Um, the shoes are a little bit big on her feet because they do have a petite point. Um, I think, honestly, when it came together, it looks good. I like um, that the dog and the owner have their own matching spike collars that are purple. Uh, I like that she's got her coffee. Uh, the animals are actually really cute for these little sets. I don't like that this skirt's not hemmed at the bottom. I don't like that the sparkles come off every time you pull and put on that skirt. You're getting glitter all over yourself. It's a glitter bomb that, you know, <laughs> a surprise glitter bomb. But either way, both these outfits are really, really cute on our girls, I think. What do you guys think? Um, comment below. Have you guys picked any of these up before? I, they're, they're labeled. It's weird. They're labeled 2018. So is this like the last Barbie movie that came out and there's a new another one coming out? Or did these just come out before the movie did? 
Uh, comment below. Let me know. I, I don't follow the Barbie movies that much, but either way, um, these were fun to get on my girls, and they're probably going to be displayed with these for a while. I love the accessories that came with this. Very usable. Um, and um, we will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.